All right guys, welcome back to my channel. Now today, I'm out here in the woods and uh, I'm checking for some trap sign, uh, coyote sign basically. And uh, you know, it's starting to snow. Hopefully y'all can see it because it's not coming down super good. It's not supposed to snow a whole lot anyway. But <sighs> something is gonna happen tomorrow. And you know, I, and if you ever watch any of my videos, you would definitely see me saying this. I always say, I love where I live, you know, and if you don't, you don't love where you live, then you need to move. Well, you know, as our new governor has taken office, Ralph Northam, he has made, or going to make, Virginia one of the worst places to live. You know, I'm originally from California, and I thank, thanked God every day that, you know, I didn't have to live in that communist state anymore. Well, here we are in Virginia getting ready to fight for our rights to carry our firearms, to go hunting, to be in these woods. And I am observing my right to carry, and I do not want that to be screwed with. I will fight and do whatever it takes to have that not happen. Now, I said before, you know, I'm not gonna say a whole bunch on here, you know, cause I didn't want to get a bunch of stuff started, blah, 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 you know, on one video that I had before. And if you're interested in seeing that video, I'll leave it right here, you can watch it. But, you know, now I'm to the point where, you know, they're not taking my guns. I'm sorry, they're just not going to do it. I'm not gonna let them. And if you're in Virginia or anywhere else that is even remotely thinking of the same crap that Virginia is, you guys need to back up and punt and think, okay, who do we want in office? You know, because that does make a difference. I mean, I cannot believe the amount of crap that they're pushing to get rid of our gun rights. It's unbelievable to me. You know, it sickens me to even think that next year, or even as soon as July, when these stupid laws take effect, that I could possibly not be able to come out here with my firearm, protect myself from any two-legged predator or four-legged predator. You know, I'm not okay with that, guys. And you shouldn't be either. You need to fight for your rights, you know. You know, today is Sunday right now, and tomorrow is the 20th. That is the day, Monday, that the Virginia Citizens Defense League and every single person in Virginia has the right to go down to Richmond and to basically march for our rights. And, you know, I had a motel room, and I'm not chickened out by any means. If you know my situation, which a lot of people do not, um, you know, I have a daughter with cerebral palsy. I have a wife that, you know, has a health condition. So I can't just up and leave everything like I want to, you know. And if I was to go down there and something was to happen and I was to get killed, hurt, in jail or whatever, then what? So having said that, guys, I will not be going. I did have a room, me and a buddy of mine, and we were going to stay. We were going to stay in the, in the Holiday Inn. But, you know, I watched the news um, on Facebook, you know, these attorneys and all these people that know a whole lot more than I do and, you know and they're anticipating something bad to happen and I can only pray to God that nothing does because that's what they are wanting they're wanting us to you know do something crazy and then they say well there you go see told you we need to get rid of guns and you know there's people on these gun sites that I'm you know on Facebook that I'm subscribed to and they're saying yeah yeah let somebody do this let somebody do that that is not the right attitude guys <laughs> By all means, it's not the right attitude, but I pray to God that tomorrow, Monday, and I'm going to have this out, I hope to God, by no later than 8 a.m. Hopefully, I'm going to have it out at midnight tonight, which will be Monday morning, 12 a.m., and I will be saying a prayer. I've been saying a prayer. I'm going to keep saying a prayer that everybody is safe there, and Antifa doesn't show up, and anybody else to try to screw our gun rats, guys, because we need to stick together. We need to fight this because this is bull crap. I'm really pissed. Um, you know, like I said, I carry every day as much as humanly possible. If I'm outside, not at work, chances of me having a pistol are pretty much 100%. You know, I said I wasn't going to say that anymore on my channel, but I'm sick of it. All right, guys, enough of my ranting. If you're going tomorrow, Godspeed. Um, I will be there with you guys in thought and prayer. Believe me, I wish I could do it. If I was single and things were different, um, I would definitely be there, but I just I can't jeopardize everything But just know guys that I support you guys. I'm an NRA member. I support everything we do for gun rights I support everything we do to help the communities Keep their gun rights, and I'm going to continue doing that 
And if that means joining a militia and helping whatever, so be it, guys. Guys, if you like what you see here, like and subscribe. God bless us all. Even if you don't like guns and you're watching this channel and you kind of agree with me, God bless you too. And we'll see you guys on the next one. Have a great day.